Hello everyone, this is Chris. And yes, as you can tell, I've decided to play on the game Dev Story once again. This is episode 2 with Mr. Chicken Monkey's back. Anyways, let's continue, shall we? It says right to the recently released TES home console by Nintendo has proven to be a massive success. Sales numbers have exceeded expe expectations by far. Well, good for them. As one cons a customer says, I love the games that come with the TES and play with a controller. It's so, it's so much more fun than on the keyboard. Ooh, right. I guess, um... Wow, okay. We need to um, make a game, develop a new game, pick a genre, strategy game, uh, topic, I don't know, that's a bit weird, adventure, ah, that's crap, can we just research in the um, topic, yeah, it's good topic only costs 10. Yeah, I love like that. Game tutorials. Well, press X on that. Um, no, not that research. Uh, game tutorials. Oh, it's forty k. We don't have fifteen research points. We got thirteen. I was wonder why I couldn't click on it. One detective, start research. Yay! Let's develop a new game, detective. You, you, you require a development license to be able to develop for this platform. Nah, we'll sit with PC and see if we can um, develop PC. That's going to cost £15,000. Don't worry, because we have a lot of money to spend. Uh, we're going to call it... I don't know what to call it, man. Hmm. I'm just gonna think. Yes, Back I've decided second. to call it the desperate. Yes, I was thinking for a good few minutes. <laughs> Let's get next. Oh, yay! 2D graphics version two. That's gonna cost thirty-five thousand in total. Let's start development of the game. So, um, this is going to be better than the other games, because we've never had a linear story, and we never had a save game feature, and we've never had a better graphics. Well. So, let's focus on the story and the quests. But, yeah, it's a bit lower. Well, I've got hay fever, my nose is annoying me. <laughs> So probably seem like a weaker. Um, lower that slightly, lower that slightly. Level design is the main focus area here. Not bad. Um, come on. I don't know if I spelled desperate right. Probably have. Yeah. We're gonna focus more on the world and graphic design. On the graphics, sorry. The sound's not, it's not really important. Yeah, the graphics is more important halfway onto this bit. Yep. I'm going to focus on the graphics. I want the graphics to level up quicker, so... Better graphics means a better game. <laughs> Right, it says here, industry report, recent studies suggest that the increasing variety of gaming devices also creates a market for more specialised games. So, 
uh, it says some platforms become more popular popular with younger gamers, while others cater for more mature age groups. As more and more developers enter the market, we expect developers to focus their games on spe specific age groups to really make an impact. Oh, that's good. I'll research in that right away after the game, after the game development that is. Um, well, I've got a design. Yeah. Any more? No. Nope. I don't think there'll be any more, I'm not sure. But anyways... Oh, look like this. No, oh, I didn't get a level up, but I'm still going to sell it. The engine didn't level up. My story requested, my dialogues did, and my level design did, and my artifact did to be sure. Oh yay, a lot of level ups! Yes, even I have leveled up. I need to research in a, quite a few things. I think I'll research in um, mono sound. Yeah, mono sound. I think that will. I think I'll have to make a new gaming engine for that to be added uh, into the games. Oh, we've got a game reviews now. Oh no! Five. That's all right. That's. That's probably one of the worst games I've ever released. I think the desperate is more like I was desperate for money. <laughs> I think I might lose fans for this. Yes, I'm losing fans because of that. Whoops. I think I'll generate a game report. At least I'm getting money for it. Ooh, today Vina has confirmed recent rumours about a new gaming console and announced the Master V. The, co the company claims that the Master V is technically superior to the massively successfully TES by Nemento and plans to release it in the coming months. Alright then. Uh, we'll have an adventure. Racing adventure game? That would have made sense. Racing simulation game. That's alright. Um, Formula One. Drag race. Alright then. That don't really make sense. I don't think Formula One cars can really drag. I'm not sure. Anyways, it should be a better graphics. Let's see. We'll improve that. We'll focus more on the gameplay and the engine. Your bank account is in the red. Thankfully, your bank has enabled to you overdraw your your account up to 50k, but be careful. If your account balance is below 50k, you will go bankrupt. Alright. Um. I think I'll lower that, I'll lower that, I think it's okay. Uh, the graphics, will design will say the same, I think we'll improve the graphic greatly on this. That's gone off the market, but this will also go on the market. I think it's done a lot better than the other game, so let's see what this will do on the market. And that's it. Yay, new record! Uh, my engine's leveled up. My 2D graphics v2 is leveled up, so it'll be 2 graphics v3. Release the game. And that console's been released on the day my game's been released. 
Oh, I saw a 10. 8, 8, 8. Love it. Oh, that's much better. 8. 6. That's not, that's pretty good, that, to be honest. Better, better than the previous game that I made, anyway. <laughs> Should get some fans for this. 40 fans, that's good. At least it's got me out of the uh, deficit. Generate game report. Oh, so it's not... It's not doing very well in North America, but it's flourishing in other parts of the world. That's what we're... Right, according to our market research, the recently published game F1 Drag Race is a surprise hit with players. The developer, the Cheeky Twats Incorporated, is fairly new to the gaming industry, but we cannot wait for what they develop next. And because of that, I think that goes up a lot more. It was going up a lot faster, I think. I uh, think I'll develop a new game. Same platform. No, 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 not that. Simulation and strategy is goes well with PC apparently. Simulation. Um, uh, I did already did an evolution simulator. I think I'll search for a new topic. Ninja! I think I'll also research in target audience and I think I'll target the young people. I've got 400 fans, I only just realised. I think the more fans you have, the more likely um, the games will get sold a lot more. So. Uh, research in target audience. What I mean by that is that I've got 402 fans. Obviously those fans will come and buy my games, majority of them would. So I think I'll get more sales because of that. Because I'll also encourage new people to um, buy my games as well. Lovely. Right, you got the young, you got everyone, immature. I think I'll go for the young. Young, ninja, action game for the PC. The ultimate ninja. That should, this should be interesting. And I think we'll focus on the story more than anything. Yeah, that looks good. Research available. Casual games. Please let me know what casual games are. I don't really understand. Right. Recent market data shows that the... G64 seems to be slowly losing market share against other PC manufacturers. I told you they'll go out of off the market, so... Oh, that's pretty good. Right, I think we'll focus more on the level design and uh, the artificial intelligence than the level design. Sorry, I thought someone was calling my name. Weird. Graphics level two. Sound level two. Um, hmm. We'll think we'll increase world design a little bit. Hmm. Oh, today Nintendo has announced that they will introduce a portable gaming device called the Game Link. Uh, the device comes with a 
interchangeable game cartridges and monochrome screen on, on a green background, built-in speakers and even multiplayer support via a connection cable. That, that's interesting. It's like basically the Game Boy. Compared to PCs and other gaming consoles, the gaming is underpowered but given the lower cost and excellent possibility it might find a huge following. Oh, it hits the shelves in the next month. Let's see the points. Yay, new record! We're doing fairly well. Now we're waiting for the reviews next week. Yep. Please get a 10, please get a 10. Screw you. Six six six. Oh, satanic. <laughs> um, such a shadow. The ultimate ninja is on the market, and then which is in the sale. Ah, that's not too bad. Generate game report. We could do better. Right. Today, the new game platform game lane by Nintendo has been released. Interesting. Um, let's research, shall we? We're gonna research in game uh, tutorials. I think I'll make a new gaming uh, engine as well. Soon. I don't know how much that'll be though. Uh, I'll cost 90 mono sound I think I'll increase ah, I don't have enough money I think we'll create another game for the mature uh, it's going to be about detective action no not detective Ninja action on this. It's going to be the bloody ninja. As you can tell, I am excellent at naming things the bloody ninja. It's <laughs> interesting. Hmm. Increase the. Uh, I think we'll leave it as that, lower the engine a little bit. I think we'll increase the level design and lower the dialogue a little bit. I don't think people would like to read the dialogues that much. And I think we'll leave the graphics and put the world design up as well. Hi, I'm Steve O'Connell, a reporter for Planet GGG. We've we've heard a rumor that your company is developing a game for mature audiences. Would would you like to be willing to give an interview about this? Yeah, because um. I think that I think that will uh, generate a hype. With the growing interest in video games, there is also a growing audience for video game magazines. These magazines offer a great way for game developers to market their upcoming games. I think I'll research that as well after releasing this. Planet GGG has recently published an interview with the Cheeky Twats Incorporated. According to the interview, the company is working on its first game targeted at mature players. M Mr. Cheeky Monkey is back, the owner and, of the, and CEO of the Cheeky Twats Incorporated. We think that players are looking for more mature content in games and we are willing to take the risk to give it to them. Lovely. It created a bit of hype. I think that's it. Well, that just created a bug. Thought that created a design, then I was gonna allow it. Let's 
It's not better than the other games, so I'm still gonna release it though. Shit. One. Disappointing. Ah! Makes you cry. <laughs> Whoops. I guess people don't like the blood and the ninja. I think it's because it wasn't as good as the other games, so they're like, what the fuck's this? Um, whoopsie daisies, let's generate a gaming report. Oh, Vina, creator of the Master V console, has announced the Vina Gear, um, a portable console to directly compete against the gaming from the inventor. Alright. I suppose this game was a learning curve. Alright, oh, fair enough. Okay, that's, ooh, I think that was the problem. Um, I'm going to research in new topic. A wheel with... That's going to be for mature gamers and all. <laughs> Right, let's develop a new game, this time it should be better, a werewolf action game, simulation game, <laughs> that's funny, um, sure people, beware of the werewolf, the werewolf, what platform should this be on? That should be on this. It should be an action game. On that engine. Wonderful. Um, we'll focus more, more on the story and quests. That's gone off the market. Lovely, lovely juggler. I want juggler now. Mm. Um, we'll focus more on the level design. I think we'll focus more on the sound and the graphic. There we are. Hmm. And we did the books. Because we had to click finish them. Yeah. There we are. There we are. I think we've done better than last time, I think. Yes, we did. On the technology side of things. They shouldn't be moaning, but... We got new, yay! I think I'll uh, research 3D graphics to put in my next engine. I think it's time to make a gaming game. It's consistent, 777. It's alright. We'll develop another, we'll, uh, I think we'll do that. Generate a game report. I think we should wait for a bit, let it sell first to have more information about it. Oh, it's doing quite well, actually. Bye-bye. I told you that PC, what type of PC will go, anyway. I think we'll um, research... Nope, I said research, we tab. Research in the 3D graphics. Yep, it's no longer supported. Goodbye. Um, we're done, haven't we? This character's a little bit slow doing these sort of things. I think I can do better than him. Um, I think I'll focus on the um, level editor.
So I think I might make another game and then make an engine, I'm not sure. We've got a lot of fans and calf, so we shouldn't worry too much about getting a de deficit. Just depends how much the uh, new gaming engine will cost us. So let's create a custom engine, get rid of the 2D graphics, blah 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 blah. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. For some reason, that's going up. Okay, then, um... 3D... No, that's 2D, retard. 3T... What the fuck? 3D... Graphics... N1... V1... That's it. I'm not, I'm not good at naming things, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, I've got 28. Wow. I'm going to skip this bit for you guys. Um, I just thought I'd just start recording again. I was going to skip that bit, but it's not long off. It's, apparently, this just popped up, and it says, This is a very special offer. Our agents have recently managed to borrow some research information, which might be of interest to you. Yeah, sure. That's all link. I researched game dev. Oh, that's interesting. I shouldn't have done that actually. Oh, I got an achievement. Invest over 100,000 in an engine. Develop a new game. The PC. Yeah, as you can tell, the PC have, have evolved because um, I've got a new engine for it. So I've got a better looking modern computer, 3D graphics, it's going to cost 40, simulation, we're going to have a simulation in 3D, revolution, yeah SimCity evolution, uh, SimCity game, yeah I'll have that, I'll have another SimCity game, SimCity, Strikes Park. Yep. Finish. New record in technology wise. New scheme. Oh, I'm gonna get a 10. Really? Really get a 10? Please get a 10. Yes! 10, 10, 10, please 10. Yeah, oh my! I'm gonna... This is gonna get us out of the deficit. Can't wait for a sequel. Don't worry guys, we'll give you a sequel. Yes! Just what we needed. Just what we needed. Ooh, look at that. That's a lot. Sales record! Yay! Because that was on the news, that should be a lot higher. Yep. Another sales record. I don't want to be in a new office quite yet. Not yet. Yay! That's on the news. That should increase the sales. Wow, that's one of our best. Ooh, what's this? Ah. That's cool. We've got 2.8 million. Wow. Let's generate a gaming report to start. And see if we can make a better gaming engine with this amount of money. Wow. I don't really want to move from the garage quite yet. Because it will cost a lot more to um, with the bills than that in the newer building, so. I think I'll end here, uh, please like, comment, and subscribe for more, um, this is the end of part 2, I'll see you, I'll see you at some point, and I hope this, I hope you guys will watch episode 3, bye bye, cheerio.